Hi Sagittarius, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back. You're the last but not the least. You know that my Sagis, I love you. And of course welcome if you have just come to this channel. Please subscribe and hit the bell on all and that goes for my Cyber Angels as well because um, you have to sometimes refresh that button apparently otherwise you won't get notified and also check your settings in your mobile device that YouTube is allowed to send you notifications that's something new I discovered it by accident and there's more information in the description box as I will be going live on a cyber fair tomorrow at 12 no 12:50 UK time and 13:50 European time there from 11 o'clock in the morning UK time till 7 o'clock at night UK time an hour later in European from 12 o'clock to 8 o'clock there are all kinds of therapists and workshops from mediumship to paragnos to yoga to tai chi you name it reflexology life coaching uh, also a non uh, non uh, addict, uh, bad things for cleaning your house uh, vacant things recipes you name it everything is out there tomorrow come and join me and the other um, people therapists and creators on that channel life and soul I'll leave the link and the information below have a look and you can also have a look on my Facebook and on my Instagram as I've posted it up there as well those are also uh, new medias my Instagram I'm on Instagram too, Facebook and my website and of course um, I'm also loading up to uh, Pinterest nowadays not only uh, YouTube but also uh, Instagram okay and there will be a surprise tomorrow so come and join me and find out what the surprise is I'll be out there um, 12.50 UK and 13.50 European so let's get started with your reading for the 31st to the 6th of September we start off with the King of Wands no this could be you but the King of Wands is Aries so you might be meeting an Aries but it doesn't ex exclude you or Leo but usually Sagittarius is the page okay but it seems that you are in your element you might have the status of the king you have reached your maturity whoa you're feeling great you're balanced awesome he knows what he wants and he takes a he he takes action as to what he wants cost what costs he's determined he's creative he's logical he thinks about it and then acts okay now he's also full of passion 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 is his nature okay that is work and creativity is also a hobby so you might be making your hobby into work you can take that step okay you might not have all the information but you've certainly be been logically busy and thinking about it how to do it well done as you've got the full so that's a new beginning on Wednesday you have the ace of cups there might be a new love like I said you might be taking your hobby and making it into your career of course you're passionate about it or you love doing it that is a new beginning or it could be a new beginning in a relationship Wow if you do fall in love with another fire sign fire and fire be careful you don't get burnt up okay know your boundaries and let the other know your boundaries as well it could be with a love sign a uh, water sign as you've got the ace of cups big that could be cancer that could be Scorpio that could be Pisces you are rising from the ashes by the looks of it like I said taking that leap of faith 
you know how to do it and you trust yourself you you are confident you have your emotions under control this is the ace of fire the ace of wands action passion boom there you go this could be a fi all the fire signs Sagittarius so it could be another Sagittarius or an Aries or a Leo that you might start a business uh, partner a business relationship with or a love relationship awesome new beginnings you've got the king of swords again air signs an air sign the king of swords is Gemini but don't exclude Libra or Aquarius this king is also a very good advisor he stands for honesty he stands for loyalty he stands for clarity and justice communication and wisdom he is a man also of action he is just as quick, if not quicker, than the um, King of Wands. Okay. Sometimes they stop, don't stop to think because they think it's very important, important to get into action and to get things clear and straight. But he knows the letter of the law, and he will defend you. He's a good advisor, so you might seek advice from a professional person or from an air sign this could be a Gemini or you could be meeting a Gemini if you are not hooked up there's definitely a lot of passion and action but air um, um, uh, makes fire burn even quicker so know your boundaries in both cases let each other know your boundaries and let them know your boundaries know their boundaries and be um, flexible with the air sign because they can multitask okay and if you don't <laughs> and they're very quick uh, either one of them you have to be very very flexible in accepting their flexibility because they go from one place to another now if you want to catch their heart and to steal their heart then make sure you can cope with it and you know your boundaries and you make clear what you want Okay, Sagittarius, now you've got the moon. There are some things you don't know, but you are in the spotlight. Okay, so somebody has an eye on you. This could be the air sign, the fire sign, or a water sign, as there is also a new beginning in love and a new beginning in passion. You know that passion doesn't last, so if you want passion to last, know the boundaries respect each other and be flexi flex flexible and keep the communication going especially with the air signs they love to communicate they can do the talk and the walk so walk next to them and, and beside them not five yards behind so if you if they go too fast then ask them to slow down look at the archways go to the archways the angels are giving you a new beginning but you need more information you need clarity it's lying underneath the king perhaps you are seeking clarity from a professional okay this could be a lawyer or a social worker or a teacher you, but you're seeking um, knowledge you're seeking information the tr remember the truth will prevail and the truth will always come out so be clear in your communications and transparent especially about things you don't understand or know listen to your intuition open your mind to new ideas and also your solar plex if you open your heart and your solar plex you can enjoy life see the joy feel the joy and f feel the warnings if there are any warnings definitely if you are in a judicial situation or if you are involved with municipalities and institutions because we have kings kings okay they rule their country their domain but he also stands for justice okay it could be as simple as a parking ticket um, that you don't know you had okay so seek the information if you unexpectedly get a letter 
you've also got the Lord, which is the Emperor. The Emperor is higher than the kings. So he also stands for adv advisor, right? So you might seek advice from a father figure, could be a fi fire or air sign, um, or you could seek advice from an Aries, as the Emperor stands for Aries. This could be a father figure or an uncle or a mature man that you respect, or it could be a professional. You have the Knight of Water here. The Knight of Water brings you news. And it could be an offer, an offer of passion. It could be an offer of love or nurturing, caring. This man is nurturing, caring, loving, and sensual and sexy. And they go for the long term. So if you are not hooked up, then you meet a water sign, and then they are for long term. They go, they're a bit like the pentacles. And this is the Aries, okay? The Lord is the Aries. We've got Aries here, and we've got the King of Fire, which represents Aries. So Aries is quite dominant and Gemini. Okay, now, we've also got the water signs, all the fire signs, and all water signs again. The knights are all signs. Now, the overall energy is the empress, so we've got a couple, so some of you might be coupling up, either in business or in love. Now, the empress is Mother Earth, and she stands for fertility, birth, birth of a child, birth of a project, birth of a new job, a new home. She's the one that's nurturing. Nurturing is here as well. Okay? She nurtures what she, the seeds that she has sown. She will nurture till they blo grow and blossom and then she plucks the harvest. But she also makes sure that her family has food again. So she will sow her second crop before the first crop has finished. So if you have invested, your crop might be blossoming and you might be harvesting um, in this week. It certainly does look like it. It's a very positive reading. And make sure that you already sow the seeds for the next crop. You might find out you're pregnant. So if you don't want to get pregnant, take precautions. Okay. Beautiful card. And she also represents Libra. So here we've got Gemini, Libra. Okay. But don't, ex don't exclude Aquarius. So I'll just repeat the signs. We've got Aries, but don't exclude the... Uh, Leo and Sagittarius, we've got Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, again all the fire signs as this is an ace, this is specifically Gemini but don't exclu exclude Libra or Aquarius again, and we've got the moon sign, that is a Pisces as well, the moon represents Pisces, so dominantly this is Pisces, Aries, um, Gemini, Taurus, oh uh, no, also Aries, Aries again, Aries is twice, and um, let me have a look, uh, Libra and Gemini, two air signs, so air signs are quite domin uh, dominant and fire signs, okay, and Pisces, okay, now you have the number 13 so you might be making new friends and number 13 is the moon of reflection you might be reflecting about the past and you also see a white crow and a black crow and the yin and yang sign so balancing things okay so balancing things, contemplating, you might be contemplating, here you are, see two things as well, also balancing things out, and uh, Libra, 
he's got the scales so or they've got the scales so also balancing out balance is a key word here contemplation and transformation resolving oppositions okay resolving an issue okay that could be the advisor that's giving you the answer how to solve um, um, something with an oppos opposition recognizing patterns seeing the big picture look at him looking at him they're the top notches they always look at things in a different perspective Mess there might be messages from another world your spiritual side like I said open your mind it's underneath the king of swords he is wisdom mind the thinkers these air signs okay so balance things out and walk away from other people's drama don't give the opposition a chance okay there you go so balance get another perspective you will be rising from the ashes to a lot of people's amazing amazement look at them looking at you wow definitely a lot of power here and a lot of force and strong will okay be nurturing and caring where you have to be okay you've got new beginnings and things that you don't know are unseen will come to the forefront truth prevails I hope you've enjoyed this reading and I hope to see you in the live on Wednesday Monday Friday Monday Friday Wednesday and Friday and tomorrow I'll be live on the platform life and soul at 12 12 50 UK and 1350 European hope to see you there take care ciao ciao like and share